I say, stand your ground. We have to stand our ground. And this is why it's gotten into this position is we've had too many people capitulate to authority. This is, this is an unbridled, uh, tyrannical expression of authority that I have never seen in my lifetime. And my mother, who's um, close to 90, has never seen it in her lifetime. It's been, it's been shocking what's happened. And if we continue to let them steamroll over us, we're going to be in an even worse position. We've got to stand our ground. We have to say, this all stops when we say no, no more. And getting, standing your ground for this particular, I think, dangerous product uh, is something that will preserve your health. It will preserve, uh, you know, your family's stability because this has been, it's, there have been so many side effects. But it will also show them that we are not to be used as human guinea pigs. We have the right to choose what goes into our body. And so I say to people, even the COVID disease, yes, it does kill people, but it's not as bad as what we're seeing with the reactions. And I think that there are going to be far more adverse effects that show up years later in the form of autoimmune disorders, in the form of increased uh, inflammation types of related diseases. And I think that we're, we're looking at some pretty serious uh, consequences down the road.